Hi, beautiful. If there's one thing that I can guarantee you will see on TikTok, it is a haircut fail. Ah! And for some reason on TikTok, they're 10 times worse than the ones on YouTube. Like they are <laughs> <clears throat> that was for dramatic effect. Um, they are severe. They're intense. These people do every single thing wrong you can possibly imagine and more. So let's watch some people attempt to cut their hair at home and completely fail. <laughs> Please, hair god. I'm just having a little moment to myself before I scream at the shit I'm gonna see. I'm sure it'll be bad. What did we think was gonna happen when we pulled a section in the front of our hair, put an elastic in, and cut a straight line? Where was the logic there? Where were we going with this? All right, next time, you gotta pull the hair from the side to the opposite side and then cut at a diagonal. Then you'll get the face framing I think you were looking for. Unless you were looking for some kind of like shelf bang, but I doubt it. And uh, this just wasn't it. Like, what is that? <laughs> what is that? No! This is what happens when Boris puts us in another lockdown. Oh. My. F God. What are you doing? Wait, why did that come out so bad? Like, what are those steps in the hair? I actually have no explanation of why that happened, except for the fact that maybe her hair wasn't clean. Maybe it had a lot of oil in it, and um, when she let it down, the, the hair just kind of clumped together. That is like my only guess of what happened, because that doesn't seem right. She did a good wolf cut, and she overdirected the hair way forward, which would give you very soft layering. So, I don't know what happened there, but it was spooky, and I hated it. I hope that she somehow fix that get some thinning shears in there and girl go in and thin that shit out oh my god you poor thing that was horrifying <laughs> Wait, I'm kind of vibing with that look. Wait a damn minute. Wait a second. Oh my god, that is one of the most intense wolf cut cuts I've ever seen. She took off like that much hair. And that's what I'm talking about when I'm like, guys, if you don't take enough hair off, you're not gonna be able to see the wolf cut. This is how much hair I mean. Like, honestly, this cut is probably gonna slay because she actually took enough hair off and nobody ever does. Okay, a little point cutting just to blend it a little bit. Oh no! Okay, okay, I know it looks really bad and I understand, right? Like I get it, why it looks bad. But if you straighten your hair and then you cut a wolf cut, it's always going to look super choppy like this. You need to like wet it and restyle it, blow it out and the layers will layer. You know, they will come for you. They will be fine. But if I were her, I'd be a little horrified right now if I didn't know that. This is bad. Follow me for more tips on how to make good life decisions. I won't be doing that, but go off. Okay, there seems to be a theme of wolf cuts, per usual. Hold on, what is that technique? <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. Whoa, I need to see that again. Why is the ponytail like that? Why are we pulling it up like this high? What is going on with this? And then she ends up like pulling the ponytail down. All the hair is being rotated to the side and then she's cutting and then, what? By the way, I definitely contributed to this trend. So sorry about that. But next time you follow the trend, follow the trend. Do it. You didn't even do it. You did something. I don't even know what that was. Uh, uh, the poor girl. I mean, she really had to go and get that fixed. And honestly, the fixed situation doesn't look that good either. Sorry. 
<laughs> oh my god, how short did you just cut it? <laughs> Mum, I didn't think you meant that short. No. Mum. Mum. Mum, I look like you. No. 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 Yo, Mum went in there for the full ass cut. Yo, she went in. That hair was long <laughs> and you really shaded your mom there you're like mom i look like you in like a bad way mom is living mom is slaying and mom you go girl and she probably needed that i saw those dead ends in there she needed a good cut she needed a good cut except this is my mom doing this to me i would have disowned her i would have i'm sorry mom i would that would have been it for us that would have been it no i'm kidding actually my dad um did a lot of crazy shit to my hair that I should have disowned him for, but I didn't. Okay, this is what I do. Once it's wet, I, sl I slick it down into my head so it's really straight. It's like it looks straight now, but it's not. And then I decide how far I'm gonna cut. Here? No. <laughs> Here? Maybe. Mm, it's a bit, that's a bit short. But YOLO! Should I just finish like that? Oh, babes, where are we going with this? It's too short to be a bang, a regular bang. And it's too long to be a micro bang. Ooh, hold on. Oh shit. What do you think? I think no. I think let's go back. Let's put it back. Let's let's put the bangs back on. I I I I think this is not it. Okay, this is them dry. Actually, I kind of like them. She really got me with that one. I feel like I would like them definitely to be shorter though. Like cuz they're still like an in between. Like they're a little long, they're a little short, they're a little too in between. I don't know. For me personally, I feel like the vibe is to be shorter than longer. Is that just me? What do you guys think? Okay, she's already doing one thing majorly wrong. Do you guys know what it is? Comment below if you know what it is. And if you don't, I'm gonna tell ya. She's pulling on her hair. She's putting tension on her hair while she cuts the bangs. You don't wanna do that because hair doesn't grow straight down from your scalp. So you put tension on it, it pulls the hair right down in front of your face where it doesn't actually lay naturally. And then it's gonna just pop right back up and be like, boop, and it's gonna look bad. It's gonna look really bad. Oh no, those were supposed to be curtain bangs. No, that is not a curtain bang, babes. It's not. If you wanna do a curtain bang, again, I said this in the beginning of the video, but you gotta section it, we're gonna part it, you know, whatever. Pull the hair to one side, cut it on a diagonal, boom, bang, bam. That's my detailed explanation on how you do a curtain bang. But I do have videos on how to do a curtain bang, so if you wanna see that, then click around. I don't know, find it in my description box or something. No. No, 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 no. If you want face framing layers, don't ever do it like this. Layers and steps are two different things, right? Layers can have can have a sense of connection to them. Steps go from one height to the next with no connection in between. So let's not do that. I've actually seen so many people do something like this where they're cutting just like pieces at a time, like expecting layers to form. No, 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 no. It's all about the over direction. It's all about the blending. Please don't ever do your layers like this. And she has such gorgeous hair and I am so sad I had to watch that go. No. <laughs> you ready? Oh. Oh. Mom, that's really short. <laughs> it's already done. Mom. <laughs> it's already done, Emily. Mom. Mom. Mom, chill. Mom. Chill with that. Back off. Oh my god. Her hair is so luscious and so long and she literally chopped it to her chin. And it irks me so much that we didn't cut above the ponytail. Ah! 
this is my new thing. Like, it's not even don't bleach your roots first. That used to be like my old thing, remember guys? And now it's don't cut below the elastic band. The elastic band is there to catch the hair. Cut above it. But oh my God, what, dude? Your mom just hacked your hair. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, it's not the same. She cut two ponytails in your head. Uh, you're gonna have length over here and length in the back, and then it's gonna be short on the sides. Like, I wish she showed us the back of her head because I'm sure it's just like a V going down. It's probably so weird. It's like a W. Maybe the W haircut is the new vibe. Maybe she's starting a trend here, but I don't think so. Look at how much hair she's holding in her hands, dude. I could only hope and dream to have that much hair in my head. I wanna make a wig out of that. Send it to me. Plus, you gave herself a buzz cut, but it goes horribly wrong. Party in the back. Okay, sorry to stop this already, but how does a buzz cut go wrong? It's literally one of the easiest things to do. Oh, bro, my mom doesn't even know I'm doing this shit. She told me not to cut it myself to wait until she could get someone to do it. <laughs> Okay, yeah. You always find a way of making it go terribly wrong. What is that? Boy, we gotta go bald now. We're going straight up zero guard. We're going bald because this is a tragic mess. Oh no. Oh, she has so much hair and I feel like she's gonna cut it off. Okay, I thought she was gonna do like a bob or something, but no, she full on shaved the sides of her head. I, I can kind of agree with her that I'm not like obsessed with it. Oh, I, I'm sorry, remember what she looked like before? This is how much hair she had before. That is the most drastic change ever. Oh my God. I agree with you though. I think you should just shave it all off. Let's just go full on and do it and bleach it white and it'll look so cool and fresh on you. It's like 2010-ish giving. Like, I don't know. It's just like not the vibe right now, but I'm so happy for you and like congratulations on this huge change that was insane oh my god and let's never cut our hair like that again okay okay <laughs> What is that? Like, I'm like annoyed. <laughs> Why did you do that? That is not a curtain bang. It's not anything, actually. Now that I look at it again, this would look so cool with like the tips of all those layers painted like white. Okay, maybe it is a look. I changed my mind. I kind of like it. As long as the color goes with it, I feel like she could actually pull this off. But it's also tragic at the same time. And I feel like she did not mean to do that at all. And it definitely did not work. Um, oh yeah. Let's put that hair back on her head. Let's reverse the video and pretend it never happened. Great. But it never happened. Ah, uh, okay. I need to I need to mentally recover after that. What are we doing? Because I am scared for all of you. Please tell me you don't just operate like that in your daily life. That was horrifying. Don't do anything like that again. All of you that I just watched today, put down the scissors. Put them down. Throw them away. Make sure there's no scissors in your whole house. None. That's it. That's my advice today. If you want to check out my hair care line or my hair color line, you can do so with the links right down below or go to xmonohair.com. That is all for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Watching. Don't forget to live your extra life and I'll see you next time. Bye